Hi viewers, welcome to my channel. I'm Sanam Pao. Okay, so this video we are going to discuss about master trip relay. So we will see what is master trip relay and its functions. Okay, so if you go to any substation, power generation station, receiving station, there are many protection relays used. Okay, these protection relays when it is uh, when when it sends the fault or when it try to trip the breaker, it will not trip the feed us directly okay so instead of that there will be auxiliary relay which will receive a strip signal from the those um, external protection relay and it will trip the breaker okay so that breaker that uh, relay is called master trip relay okay so okay. for this master trip relay ANSI code is 86 okay in in electrical standard for every uh, protection relay there is uh, some code is given okay that is ANSI code it is called okay so for this trip relay uh, this ANSI code is 86 now we will see the function of uh, master trip relay how it is working okay so this is a basic function block diagram for the master trip relay how it is working okay so this is circuit breaker in every circuit breaker there will be two coil closed coil open coil okay and now this is master trip relay okay master trip relay has two coils one is set coil another one is reset coil okay set coil means trip reset okay so this master trip relay will have multiple no contacts okay so one no contact will be used to trip the breaker uh, other no contacts will be used to take uh, feedback of this master trip relay okay so to this uh, set coil or trip coil <coughs> see like this the external relay contact will be connected parallelly okay so this uh, signal coming from differential protection relay this signal is coming from instantaneous uh, trip relay this uh, si trip signal is coming from over current relay this uh, trip signal is coming from earth fault relay so like this you can add uh, any trip command <coughs> parallelly to this master trip relay set coil okay so this master trip relay will have Two, as I told you, two set coil, okay. One, uh, two coils, one is set coil, reset coil, okay. So once any external relay is activated, this will trip the, this will uh, give signal to the set coil, okay. So uh, suddenly, instantaneously, this relay will activate, this uh, relay will close the NO contact and it will open the breaker, okay. So this uh, relay will work like a latch relay, okay. Once this fault activated breaker is tripped, you have to reset manually or electrically so giving uh, resetting by giving uh, supply to reset coil or mechanically you can reset the uh, master trip relay unless you reset the breaker will remain in open condition or trip condition okay so from any external trip protection relay so this is the only one relay will receive the uh, fault command or uh, fault signal or trip signal and this will uh, decide to uh, <coughs> open or trip the breaker okay that is called this is master trip relay and this ANSI code is 86 okay this is the most <coughs> relays used in major uh, substations uh, in uh, uh, industrial receiving station and also a uh, power protection uh, power uh, generation station okay so one more uh, main uh, important uh, thing is this master trip relay is not sensing any trip directly that means this will not sense or it will not monitor any protection okay so this will receive external signal and it will react based on the signal only okay so this master trip relay has another name called lockout relay okay this is the one uh, called lockout relay also okay so if you are new, new for my channel if you are watching first time for my channel please do subscribe also check my videos playlist i am updating i am putting videos for uh, plc programming and other hvacs and electronics as well as electricals okay so if you are interested in any other topics please do watch my videos and support for me okay so thanks for watching i will meet you in next video till then bye from senator